Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. I am Abbas on behalf of Saud Harman Production. We have taken an initiative to start scientific series on our channel and we will try our level best to upload one video per week. And this is our first video. I hope all of you will like this video and will support us by subscribing our channel. Today's topic is about coronavirus testing. You all are listening every day that so many tests have been done in India and other parts of the globe. Why I have used the word globe here, it's because this coronavirus has been declared as pandemic by WHO, that's World Health Organization. The question here is, how these tests are being done? In this video, I will explain to you the answer of this question, inshallah. There are two types of tests. One is swab test and the other is blood test. In this video, I will explain the second one, that is the blood test. The reason I will not explain the swab test is, this test is a complex test. It needs a PCR machine, that is the polymerase chain reaction machine and other related things. And it also needs a well professional doctor and well skilled molecular biologist. And the second reason is, I am making this video for general audience. This test is quite easier, that is the blood test. You don't need any doctor or molecular biologist to do this test. Everyone can perform this test at home. This test is same just like the blood sugar test. And this test works on the principle that if you are already infected with the virus and your body is producing antibodies to fight the virus in order to protect yourself. Here is an Islamic edge to this test. That is, Almighty Allah has already provided us antidote to any infection in the form of antibodies. So this is a blessing from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala on everyone, devoid of any cost, sect or religion. So we should be very thankful to him. Now I will explain to you the anatomy of testing kit. The testing kit consists of two points. The first point which is designated as S known as sample. And the second point which is designated as B known as buffer. And it also consists of three lines or regions we can say. The topmost is designated as C which is known as controller and in the middle it's M which shows IgM that's the antibody and the lower one that's the G which shows IgG that's the antibody. Now I will explain to you how test is done. You will prick your finger with a needle and you will draw some blood or point of your blood almost 10 microliters and then you will place this amount of blood at the point S known as sample and then you will add buffer solution at the point B. This buffer solution will be provided to you along with the testing kit. Its function is it will uplift the blood up to the C region. Then you have to wait for almost 10 to 15 minutes. After waiting for 10 to 15 minutes, the results will appear. If the kit shows only line at C, that means your test is negative. That means you don't have any virus in your body. And it also shows the kit is running properly or we can say correctly. Actually this C line or C region is a checking line for the testing kit you are using. If there is no any C line shown, that means the testing kit you are using for blood testing of coronavirus is faulty. If the kit shows line at M, it means you have been infected by this virus for the first time and currently you are coronavirus positive and you need to isolate yourself in order to protect your nearby people and you must go to hospital to quarantine yourself. If the kit shows line at G, it means you have been infected by this virus multiple times because IgG, this immunoglobulin is 
which is produced by the body is a secondary effect to any infection so if you have been infected for the first time that time igm will be produced by your body so that is the primary effect while as if the line shows at g that means you have been infected by this virus multiple times because this is the secondary effect it also suggests that you are coronavirus positive if the kit shows line at all the regions that is c m and g it means you have been infected with this virus 2 to 3 weeks earlier but the point is you are in a recovering phase we can say you are some sort of immune to this virus now but you can still spread this virus to other people therefore you must quarantine yourself it also suggests that you are corona virus positive in nutshell we can conclude that if your kit shows line at c and g you are corona virus positive and if the line is at c and m you are also corona virus positive and if the line is at all the regions that is c g and m you are corona virus positive but if the line shows only at c region that means that testing kit is running correctly and you are corona virus negative and then you need to consult your doctor and you have to show this test to him then he will suggest to you to go for further testing for example rt pcr that is reverse transcription reverse transcriptase pcr polymerase chain reaction at last my message to all of you is that the vaccine for this sars cov2 that is the corona virus has been discovered i know you are shocked but the vaccine is simple that is stay home stay safe thank you for watching this video